But LM147, now Brian could go on to say that uh, he had plenty of seconds at the Nationals, but uh, he tried his hardest for that first, but uh, didn't quite make it. Well, we can only hope that he's going to be back in the Nationals this time. Uh, we'll have to Oh, 
across the foot. Right, here we go then. Away from the line. It is another hit on the cover. And it's not my right to play. Six of Russia League under that first bench. We'll let them sort themselves out on that one, I reckon. And oh, there we go. There we go, big three car uh, coming together on that uh, bottom bed. Then Steve Smith in stride 20, Peter Ellis in Scarborough 240 is the other one there. Right, here we go then, more back seven to hand from the line. Uh, we've got Phil Stick on the outside in stride 200, we've got Phil Stenson on the inside of the back car, we've got Andy Stenson, oh, there we go, we've got a first car over. Off the wheel, 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 off the wheel. In York 71 and Mike Gallagher in Leewood 7. We have people tying on points, so we've got nine cars out there, a very full grid for the Super Saloon. And we're up and running. Here we go then, from the inside is Tom Oakley in SD82, but they're absolutely like six of that as they throw it all into turn one. So hopefully they're all going to uh, come out. And uh, we've got red flags on that one. So there we go. Then they go off the line and Peter Bott gets the power of Richard Beaumont is there alongside. So as they come down and Peter Bott it is and uh, oh, well, big come together there. Put start push by uh, Michael Big, the real big come together. And uh, trying to start the morning on the Anthons come up and the power goes down then. And uh, here's T35 and Jake Smith this time so they're going to try and be using the corner. Go a little wider. After the out, six, 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 Scarborough 240, then Paul Lockwood in that right where it's 12, and it's Tinker and Berwick side by side, and Martin Tinker there in York 71 has that third place.
the red flag. I'll have to do it all over again. Quite spectacular. That one. Well, it's seven car. So Russell Warbank running in that third place position ahead of the Gloucester 20 car. I think he was running in fourth at Bob Aston in uh, Gloucester 20. So, uh,
five one car. Then we are sponsored at eight. Chase down by Rob Corbett in T7. Up in the front, he's still side by side action. It's uh, Brinell 27 on the east side, E56 on the outside. And it's all happening in the top corner. The E56 drops back a spot. Uh, 
بلکه آن نرمه بان Just as you'd expect, an extremely level break, but it's just about Evesham 100 on the inside. 
Bristol side travel one on the outside, that's the leading two as they go into that first bend. Martin Lawton coming through, somebody's got it sideways. That's a cost of 55, but... Uh, oh, there we go, over on the far side, I think that's the maestro of Martin Lawton in uh, Evesham. Uh, travel three uh, rolls it over going down the far side, so uh, red flags uh, come out on uh, that one. Well, suffering a fair amount of damage but uh, the uh, safety mechanism there, the roll cage etc etc holding up and uh, doing what it should have done and uh, those of you that know Martin very well, we don't mean this flippantly, then if we say to you he's talking then uh, you'll know he's a -OK. <laughs>
see that? Oh, red flags are flying. What a shame. Oh, dear me. Didn't see that. Car on its roof on the top, mate. So, uh, he's uh, mum and dad. So, uh, there we go. That's it. Alan Force. So I know his dad's a Terry. We're there losing three places. CK3. Seven, uh, chasing us in that second place. Oh, there's a wicked roll over there. Race 40 there. Blue through the air. Mark Smith. But uh, he looks to be okay. Uh, the Class 5 final. Right. Les Grice makes the better start. And we've got red flag straight away. And I don't know what Neil Thomas is trying to do to Paul Watson. But uh, he's all over the back of him. 16. And the names to go with those numbers are as follows. And uh, we have left off, here they come. And it's Lee Corbett, the favourite crossing over in North Shropshire 420. And he's got about 10 cars all jostling for those important positions. And let's see if they all get safely around. Yes, we breathe a sigh of relief. And oh, don't speak too soon. Oh, there's lots of T-boning going on. Oh my goodness me. Straight into the Marshall's post. And we're going to have, obviously, red flag. There's a go into the last lap. And it's a very frustrating Les Drive sits there in second. Neil still third. And he goes this time. He's got him down the outside. He's going to go down the outside. And it's going to be late on the brakes. So and what's going to happen here? And Ryan Griff is forcing his way back. Oh, Les has gone round. And it's 200 takes. So Neil second. Paul Watson's third. It's going to be Jaffa takes fourth in your one. Head in a sponsored Class 6 final. Partaking in that Steve Black, Andy Johnson, Steve Hughes, Paul Cosby, Leroy Cuff, Derek Dwyer, Brian Leyland and Mickey Manning. Away we go. Very clean out of the game. My 25 it is. It's the first one to show. Oh, a major, major incident down the straight in front of us. So, disappointment now. Well, me, how are we going to seat? We'll have our third attempt in Class 2s. Uh, this time we've got a much more equal... Oh, my goodness me. What did I say? I didn't even get a chance to get started on that one. And uh, we all saw what happened. This time it was the unfortunate turn of Tomo. Engines are just starting to get wound up now. We're going to look for that red flag to drop. We've got a green light. Away we go. With the Harvey Motorsport Engineering and NWR Class 8 final. Oh dear, contact, big contact. Somebody flew over the top of uh, one of the other cars there. I think that was Steve Rogers in the AC7. He's right. There's a battle on there for the second place. Everyone wants to have an
total chaos and carnage up there on the turn one. Yeah, Mark Lawrence in North Shropshire zero, he's got one lap left to try and do it. Finds a gap there on the inside in York 17. Mark Lawrence in the turn one, trying to run around the outside of that pit lane. He's going to run around the outside of that pit lane. He's going to run around the outside of that pit lane. He's going to run around the outside of that pit lane. York 17, absolutely neck and neck. As they go into that top end for the final time, Mark Lawrence on the outside. Headlong on the inside, it's a dash to the line. Yeah, so. So, so, we're still going to be driving in the cloudy way. 